Okay, so hi, good evening, everybody. How are you? How do you feel today? What about your weekend? How was it? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How was your weekend? Was it good? Your weekend? Perfect. Perfect. Okay, Irvin, that's awesome. Okay. All right, that's the attitude. What about your weekend, Jose? How was your weekend? Irma, good evening. How are you? Fine, teacher. Fine, teacher. Okay. What about your weekend? Uh, good. 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 Okay. Yes. And your weekend, Marco? Good Excuse evening, teacher. Uh, I go to sleep. Mm, you so slept a lot. Okay, that is good. All right, so I'm happy that you are here and we are going to start with today's class. We are almost done with this first module, right? So, uh, hi, Tanya. Good evening. Okay, so then we are going to start with today's class and the quote of the day, Irma, help us read it, uh, reading this, please. Okay, Tanya. Worry less, smile more. Yes, so it says worry less, smile more. So smile. worry, yes, worry is preocuparse. Less, menos. So preocuparse menos, smile more. Yes, yeah? so sonreír más. Preocuparse menos y sonreír más. Yes. Okay, so that is the quote of the day. And then today's agenda, um, we have the warm up, we have vocabulary, we have grammar. Today we are going to make a combination of every single thing that we have seen. We are going to include there is and there are. And we also have preposition of place. We have the practice time, we have the speaking part, we have listening as well. But first we are going to start with the tone twister for today. So today we have this one, which is really easy. It's not difficult, it's easy, okay? So it goes like this. Fred fed Ted bread and Ted fed Fred bread. Fred fed Ted bread and Ted fed Fred bread. So easy, okay? All right, so we're going to say it one by one, okay? One by one. I'll give you 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Practice it. Practice it, you alone. Fred, 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 and Ted, Fred, 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 Okay, so yes. All right, so the first Fred. time you can say slow. Lo puedes decir así como espacio, slow. Okay. Fred fed Ted bread and Ted fed Fred bread. Okay, so let's see, one by one. All right, so let me see, Yvette, you go first, Yvette. Okay. Fred fed Ted bread and Ted fed Fred bread. Very good, Yvette. Yes, Irvin. Fred fed Ted bread and Ted fed friend bread. Yes, perfect. Jose. Fred fed Ted bread and Ted fed bread. Uh, Fred bread, bread, pardon. Okay, don't worry, Jose. Well done. Irma. Fred, Ted, Ted, Fred, and Ted, Ted, Fred, Fred. Yes, very good. Michael. Fred, Fred, Ted, Fred, mm -hmm. and Ted, Fred, Fred, Fred. Okay. Suleyma. Fred, Fred, and um, Ted, Fred, Fred. Okay, I think that Suleyma is having issues with her internet connection. Yeah, I couldn't hear you. 
Okay. Uh, all right, Erica. Liliana, are you there? Fred said Ted, bread, and Ted, Fred, Fred, bread. Yes, thank you. All right. And Tanya. Okay, so I think that they are busy, okay, probably. Okay, so let's keep moving, guys. And well, we are going to start by talking about vocabulary. So as you can see right here, we have asking for directions and we also have giving directions vocabulary. So let's see, Yvette, help us reading asking for directions and Erebin, please giving directions first, Yvette. And then once Yvette finished, Okay, go, um, Erebin. Read all of this, Yvette, all. Mm -hmm. How can I get up? Where is it? Where is Irving? Do you want to or do you solo? No, yes. No. Okay. You, yeah, just read all of that. How can I get to? Mm -hmm. okay. Where is they? How far is they from they? Mm -hmm. Is there a around here? Mm -hmm. Could you tell me how to, to go? Mm -hmm. How do I find? I find. I find. I find. Yes. Irving. Go straight ahead. Turn back. Go back. Turn left or, or um, turn right. Go along. Cross. Take the first, second row. Uh, take the first second lot on the left. It's on the left, it's on the right. Go mm -hmm. back. Okay. So guys, we're going to discuss how, how to ask for direction. Okay, so how to ask. Como preguntar por direcciones? How? Okay. So right here we have the first one. Of course, you are going to add the complement, okay? So here we just have the question. Aquí solamente tenemos la pregunta, pero nos hace falta la, el complemento. So for example, how can I get to multiplaza? How can I get to metro centro? How can I get to the downtown? How can I get to the pharmacy? Whatever place. ¿Cómo puedo llegar a? And you need to include the place. You need to include the, the place, okay? So how can I get to um, the hospital? How can I get to the movie theater? How can I get to um, the drugstore, right? So where is the, the same thing? We have the question, but we are missing the complement, okay? So, tenemos la pregunta, pero nos falta el complemento, que el complemento es el lugar. Where is the university? Where is the hotel? Where is the pharmacy? Where is the bakery? Where, where is the police station, etc. So, how far is the from the? So, ¿Qué tan lejos está la librería de la universidad? So, how far is the, the bookstore? How far is the bookstore from the university? ¿Qué tan lejos está un lugar de otro? How far is the university from the bakery? Okay. ¿Qué tan lejos está la universidad? de la panadería. Yes. So then we also have, is there a, a space around here? For example, is there a pharmacy around here? ¿Hay alguna farmacia alrededor de aquí? 
is there um, a bakery around here? Is there a hospital around here, etc. right? Then we also have this one. Could you tell me how to get to? Me podrías decir cómo llegar a? Could you tell me how to get to? Could you tell me how to get to the university? Could you tell me how to get to the pharmacy? Could you tell me how to get to Salvador del Mundo? Could you tell me how to get to um, what? To Pizza Hut, etc. Okay, different places. And then we also have the last one. How do I find? Como encuentro? How do I find the supermarket? How do I find El Salvador del Mundo? How do I find the pharmacy? How do I find the university? How do I find the hospital? Whatever, okay? As you can see, those questions, guys, are for you to ask for directions. Yes, you can use them all. Puedo utilizar cualquiera y al final es almost the same. Es casi lo mismo, right? It's almost the same. Casi lo mismo en todas. La respuesta es cómo llegar a un lugar. Yes. Then we also have giving directions. So how to give directions. Cómo puede guiar a alguien. Con direcciones, right? So giving directions. The first one, go straight ahead. Manténgase caminando en dirección recta. Go straight ahead. Caminar en dirección recta. Recto. Go straight ahead. Vaya a ser recto, le dicen. Go straight ahead. Okay. Turn back. Turn back. Dar la vuelta hacia atrás. Turn back. And go back. Regresarse. Turn back. Girar hacia atrás. Go back, regresarse. Go back. Yes, go back, regresarse. Turn left, girar hacia la izquierda, left. Turn left. And then we also have turn right. Girar hacia la derecha, the opposite. Yes. Go along, go along, ir a lo largo de, right? Go along, ir a lo largo de la calle tal. Go along, eh, what? Go along Roosevelt Avenue. Yes, go along, ir a lo largo de, okay? So then we also have cross, that means cruzar. Cross, yes, cross the street, se cruza la calle, cross the street, yes, cross, cruzar. Then we also have take the first, take the first road on the left. Toma el primer camino a la izquierda. Take the first road uh, on the right. Tomar el camino. Hacia la derecha. Take the second road. Tomar el segundo camino. On the left. On the left. Izquierda. Take the second road on the right. Okay. Tomar el segundo camino a la derecha. Okay. It's on the left. It's on the left. Está a la izquierda. Cuando le dice, y lo va a ver ahí en la izquierda. It's on the left. Está en la izquierda. It's on the right. Está a la derecha. Yes. Go past. Tiene que pasar tal lugar. Tiene que pasar la farmacia. Go past the pharmacy. Pasar un lugar. Go past the pharmacy. Go past Banco Cuscatlán. Yes etc. 
go past, pasar un lugar. Okay. So once again, pronunciation, pay attention because you are going to use this for the class activities. Okay. So how can I get to how? No how, how. Where is the? How far is the from the? Is there a around here? Could you tell me how to get to? Could you tell me how to? This T sounds like an R. Suena como una R. Could you tell me how to, how to get to? And then, how do I find? This D, esta D también suena como una R. How do I find? Okay, for your pronunciation, para que su pronunciación se escuche más norteamericana. Yes. And then, go straight ahead. Go straight ahead. Turn back. Go back. Turn left. Turn right. Go alone. Cross. Take the first road. On the left, take the first road on the right. Take the second road on the left. Take the second road on the right. It's on the left, it's on the right. Go past, okay? Now let's continue. And we have more information about vocabulary because you are going to use it. Traffic lights, as you already know, semáforo. Traffic lights. The roundabout. The roundabout. What is roundabout? What is a roundabout? What do you think? Redondel. 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 La rotonda. Yes, the roundabout. Then we also have the sidewalk. What is sidewalk? Sidewalk. Correct. The zebra crossing. Uh -huh. The zebra El paso peatonal. Paso de zebra. El paso peatonal. Así se dice. Zebra crossing. Okay. Then we also have crossroad. This is the crossroad where we have? Crocai. Yes. Exactly. And as you remember, turn left, turn left, turn right, go straight, directo, go straight, go past, pasar, go past, cross, cruzar. At the corner of, en la esquina de, at the corner of, at the corner of First Avenue, en la esquina de la primera avenida, at the corner of Fifth Avenue, you will see the bakery. You will see Panaria Rosario, etc. So next to, you know what is next to. Ya saben que es next to. You already know what is opposite as well. Ya lo cubrimos. And between. You know what is between already. Okay, do you have any question? Do you have any doubt? Questions, doubts? Not right now? Okay, let's continue. Then let's start then with today's class. Okay, we already covered the vocabulary that we had. And then we're, we're going to start with prepositions of place. Okay, so let's see, uh, Marco, Help us reading the question and the answer, please, Irma. So, Marco, you read the question and Irma, you read the answer. Okay, go, Marco. Mm, I think you are on mute. Okay. Um, uh, proper, uh, proposition of place. Yes. The question. Uh, where is the park? I cannot learn. Where is the park located? 
where is the park locator? Yes. Is it, is it locator among many places? Okay. Where is the sport palace locator? It's a locator oh. on various street in front of the park. Okay, thank you, Marco. Irma, the other two. <clears throat> Where is the more, the more loca located? Located is the located near the restaurant. Where is the shore? Is located at the school. Yes, okay. So, where is the park located? Located. Yeah, so where is the park located? It is located among many places. Among means in medio, but many places. No es lo mismo que between. Between es en medio. Among es en medio. Pero among, mira lo que dice. It is located among many places. Está alrededor, ok, está en el medio, pero lo rodean muchos lugares. So the park is located among many places. So we have the mall, the restaurant, the arrows company, the book world, the city hall, the church, the school, the sport palace, the bank, many places. And the park is among all of those places, ok. Then where is the sport palace located? It is located on Barrio Street in front of the park. Barrios Street in front of the park. The sport palace is right here. It is located on Barrios Street on. Remember preposition on, on, on. Yes, and then we have, where is the mall located? It is located near the restaurant. So let's see. Here we have the mall. So it is located near, near the restaurant. Which other um, direction can we give according to the, uh, the vocabulary that we have studied? Which other location? Which other direction can we give? Where is the mall? Where is the mall located, guys? Where is it? Mm -hmm. Where is it? It's uh, it's located on First Avenue. Excellent. Street. It is located on First Avenue. This is okay. the avenue. In Very good. In front of the park. In front of the park. Perfect, Jose. That was excellent. Yes. So where is the church? It's located past the school. So we have the church and it is located past, pasando, past the school. Yes. So past. All right. So then let's start this one. And it says complete the conversations using a preposition from the box. Okay. So let's see. The sport palace is, where is the sport palace? Which preposition goes right here? Here uh, is this, uh -huh. uh, The sport palace is what? Uh -huh. The bank. Is in front. Oh. Pero también se puede decir oh, pasando. Pas. No, no. Podría sí, ser next to. Enfrente. Al banco. Ok, so let's choose just one. Yes, we can use many. Podemos usar todas, right? La mayoría. So, where? Let's choose just one. Where is the sport palace? The sport palace is... Mm -hmm. Past. Past the bank. Pasando el banco. Okay. Number two. 
the city hall, the city hall is, is where? The church and book world. Where is the city hall? Here uh, it is. Between. Between, yes. Between. Between, yes. It is between, it says, the church and the book world. Yes. Number three. The restaurant is... The restaurant is... The restaurant is... Across. Across. Next to. Next to. Next to First Avenue. Across uh, First Avenue. So across, across is like cruzando, cruzando una calle. Uh, diría yo que es past, pasando la primera avenida. Past. Okay, so the restaurant is past First Avenue. Mm, okay, so along means a lo largo de, a lo largo de. Then number four, the church and the city hall are where where uh -huh. the church and the city hall in where front, the of, front of in front in of front yes this one was in front in front of yes in front of you see this one even though we don't have it right here even though we don't have it right here, we can also say on, sobre, on First Avenue, right? Sobre, sobre la Primera Avenida. We can also use that one, okay? Questions, doubts, questions, doubts. Not right now? Okay. So now we're going to do something and you are going to work with your partner. Employees information. So you need to get your partner's information. You are going to ask her name or his name, the office or a main phone. This is something that you need to invent, okay? Not real, just invent. So office and main phone number, invent, okay? Not real ones, invent. Then the workplace, the name of the company. This one, if you want, yes. Okay, the workplace, the job position. Okay, this one, yes, the job position. The department, el departamento, no el departamento San Salvador, no, el departamento en el que trabaja usted. Yes, for example, marketing, human resources, etc. Okay, the address as well. And your ID, this one, invent. The ID, invent, okay, invent. The office main phone number, invent, okay? Um, do you have any question about this? Do you have questions about what you are going to do? The direction tiene que ser larga o corta. No, just a, a, a short one, corta, oh, okay. yes. Jose? Uh, the name is uh, de nosotros. Yes. Yes, you are going to okay. interview. Va a entrevistar a su compañero. Okay. Yes. You are going to interview your, your classmate. Okay. So, but before we go, I'm going to ask, uh, well, no, I'm going to take the attendance. Give me one second. Okay. So, here we go. Brian Antonio Castro Molina. Cristian Marcelo Ramírez Morán. Cristian Marcelo Ramírez Morán. I think that he's having issues with the internet. Elmer Alexander Coto Sorto. 
Eric Alexander Escalante Barrias. Erika Beatriz Reyes Méndez. Present. Thank you. Franklin Emanuel Flores Portillo. Present. Gerson Josué Abarca Aranda. Irma del Tránsito Alegría Martínez. Present. Thank you. Irving Francisco Peraza Herrera. Present. Yvette Elvira Aquino Peña. Present. Thank you. Johnny Iván Argueta Argueta. José Enrique Siliesar Alas. Present. Thank you. Jocelyn Guadalupe Romero Ebra. Kelvin Omar Martínez Ramírez. Liliana Beatriz Jiménez Colorado. Present. Thank you. Luis Ernesto Nuila Castro. Okay. Marco Rubén García Rodríguez. Present. Reinaldo Alberto Vázquez Torres. And Tania Vanessa Moreno Navas. Present. Thank you. Suleima Guadalupe Chicas Aguila. Present. Thank you. Okay, let me just share my screen once again. Okay, once you have completed this, once you have completed this, cuando ya haya terminado esto, once you have completed this, let me see. Teacher, estoy teniendo problemas con mi internet. Yes, Christian, I, I, I know. Okay, so once you have completed this, you are going to go to this one. And you are going to write sentences about the places around your workplace. De los lugares que están alrededor de su lugar de trabajo. For example, yes, the pharmacy, eh, si quiere agregar el nombre. Eh, for example, Liliana. I'm sorry, Liliana. I didn't hear you. No se le escuchó, Liliana. Será que puede dar la indicación de la primera, por favor. Ah, yes. Okay. So this one, you need to get your partner's information. Tiene que pedirle la información a su compañero. The name, the workplace, the office telephone number, but this one, it, it should be invented. Lo va a inventar. Okay, no es el número real de su compañía. The job position, yes, esa sí es real. Okay, la posición de que usted tiene en su trabajo. The department, el departamento en el que trabaja, no en el departamento San Salvador, La Libertad, no. El departamento en el que trabaja usted. Okay, human resources, marketing, etc. So the address, la dirección de su trabajo, a short one, una cortita. Okay. And the ID, this one is, the ID is the number of identification, but you don't need to add it, um, the, the real one, no agregar el real, okay? You need to invent, tiene que inventar. That is on this one, okay? So then you are going to move to this one and you are going to write sentences about the places around your workplace. You are going to use prepositions of place to describe their location, for example. So if you work around where, uh, Marco, you, Universidad, I don't know, um, Universidad Tecnológica, right? So which places do you have around? Yes. ¿Qué lugares tiene alrededor? Right? So there is a bakery, okay? The bakery is in front of Universidad Tecnológica. Eh, the restaurant, pone el, el nombre del restaurante y dice dónde se encuentra. Is next to the bakery. All right, so five sentences. Five. Using prepositions of places. Uh, okay, Erben, I will, I, will, I will share it. Okay, so do you have questions about this one? Do you have questions? Do you have doubts? Something that is not clear about this activity. No, not right now. Okay, so once we are done with this, I will give you another instructions, okay? But right now, just this with your partner and this with your partner, okay? I mean, obviamente, no, algunos no trabajan en el mismo lugar, ¿verdad? No lo va a hacer junto con su compañero. Lo va a hacer basado en su lugar de trabajo. ¿Ok? 
So let's see. Um, okay, Irvin. I'm I'm going to okay. I'm going to share the link. Where am I the link in a moment? So Irvin, you need the link for the class. Where is Irvin? Yes. That link. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Perfect. So I I send it to you then. Yes, Eloman. Okay, let me let me see. I'm going to send Brian and Marco. Okay, Erica, you will go with Franklin. Well, Christian, are you there? Well, I don't know if you're having some issues with the internet. Um, okay, so I'm going to send Arima with Yvette. Eliana, you will go with Sulaima, Tanya, you will go with Jose and Irvin. Uh, and let me see, Christian, you will go with Erica and Franklin. Yes. Okay. Office my phone, say the number of the phone. El office by the phone, say Yvette, Yvette, aquí no, verdad? Mm -hmm. Pone uh, cualquier número, verdad? Sí. Bueno, yo puse el 243 2400. Ok. English. Oh, yo se lo voy a decir teacher. uno por uno. Uh -huh. <risa> <risa> teacher, este, <risa> deletreado. Eh, pregunta, este, si yo quiero colocar eh, jefa de compras, ¿cómo tendría que hacerlo? Manager, man, manager, sí, ¿verdad? Pero el compras. Mm, head of, I would say something. Ok, yo le recomendaría que diga head of purchasing. Ah, ok, ok. Thank you, teacher. All right. Ok, Yvette, si gusta me dice su número. Ok, vaya. Tú, uno por uno. Sí. No. Vaya. Tú, tú. Ajá. Three, four, sí. uh -huh. uh, young teacher, young, young, normal. Oh, dash. 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 Five, D, uh, uh -huh. five seven, sí. one, nine. Okay. Two, two, three, four, five, seven, one, One night. Yes. ¿Y el okay. tuyo? ¿El tuyo me dijo que era? Sería tú. Ajá. Four. Uh -huh. One. Uh -huh. Three. Uh -huh. Two. Ajá. Four. Uh -huh. Zero. 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 Ajá. Zero. Dos. Dos okay. zero. Okay. Two zeros. Okay. Two zero. Okay. Workplace. Uh, workplace. Uh, pastelería Anthony's. Bakery. Bakery. Bakery Anthony's. Bakery. Anthony's Bakery. Yes, Anthony's Bakery. Okay. Drumette. Drumette. 
Ajá. De. D. I. O. M. I. T. D. R. D. R. O. O. M. M. Ajá. I. D. Ok. D. D. T. T or D. I. D. T. E. D. Van juntos. E. D. Ay, espero que lo escrita bien. Ok, y D. Sería. Sería D. D. R. 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 O. R. O. N. M. M. N. N. Ah, ok. M. I. 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 D. I. D. Ajá. Ah, I. No. I. D. Sin la. Ramen. Ajá. T. Ay, no. Sin la T. Sin la T. Ajá. Ah, okay, ah, ok, ok. A ver si lo escribí bien. Ajá. Ok. Ok. Ajá. Quiere ver. Ajá, ajá. Dirección. Ajá. Uh -huh. ah, um, okay. No, este. Job position. Job position. Ah, department. Ah. No. Sí. Aquí dice teacher que ah, debe de ser. Part of credit. Ajá, correcto. Okay, in you? Do you have any question? Mm. Uh, no, por el momento. No, no at the moment. Vamos bien. No at the moment. No at the moment. Okay. Eh, eh, una pregunta o question, question, question. Ok, yes. Eh, la pronunciación de diseñador gráfico es. Graphic designer. Graphic designer. Designer. Mm -hmm. Designer. Ok. Ok, ok. okay. Mm, Contra. Are you a graphic designer, Franklin? Oh, yes. Are you a graphic designer, Franklin? Yes, I am a Perfect. designer, a graphic. A graphic designer. <laughs> okay, so you have a lot of creativity. Okay, you have a lot of creativity. You are very creative. Eh, anima, eh, verdad, déjame si comprendo. Me pregunta qué es lo que hago, ¿verdad? Oh, no, I'm telling you that you are very creative. Yo soy bien creativo, entonces. Mm, un poco, sí, la verdad. A little bit, a little bit. A little, a little bit. And, okay, which, which are your favorite colors? Uh, my favorite color is a pink, red, and black. Okay, those three, okay. Do you make combinations with those three colors or no? Yes, a uh, combination of little. Oh. Um, and para lo que yo hago en diseño, sí me gusta combinar esos colores. Very good, okay. So red. Pink and black in black. Yes. Perfect. And you, Erica? Uh huh. What about you? Uh, no sé cómo, si está correcto como lo escribí, pero quise decir eh, internal audit. Yes. Auditor interno. Yes, internal audit. Okay. All right. So you are good at numbers. Hello. You are good at numbers. Do you like math? 
mathematics? Do you like? Do you like numbers? Ah, oh, yeah. Yes, okay. Perfect. Okay. Okay, continue. Continue. Okay, continue. Let me see. I'm going to check everything. Kosovo. Lo utilizamos bastante. Okay. The ID. It's a number. Six H seven nine. Six A. Seven nine. Uh huh. Eh, solo estos. Cuatro números. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, no sé si llenamos el mío o de Tania. Eh, ¿Qué gusta? Teacher, yo tengo Pero solo termino de llenar este. una pregunta. Yes. Que la dirección de mi trabajo no me lo puedo. Ah, ok, so invent. Porque yo lo sé que está la parte de Ciudad Real en Chalcuapo, pero así nada más. <risa> ok, just y right llama, now. Y, yes. y le dicen, lo conocen por ex beneficio, la mica. La mica. Okay. Que ya hacían café antes y ahora solo es bodega. Estoy en clase. It is near eh, Ciudad Real, ¿verdad? Sí, Ciudad Real. It is near... Entonces, sería, sería Santa Ana, Ciudad Real. Okay, so... Beneficio la mica. It is in Santa Ana. And... It's near Ciudad Real. Oh. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Just general because you don't you don't know it by heart. So just give a general. Entonces it it's near pegado. It is near. Es, es cerca. Está cerca de. Ah. Pero se puede poner como contiguo a... Como uno dice, ah, contiguo a tal parte. Ah, yes. Como pegado. Yes. Next to. You can use next to. Próximo a. Próximo Ajá. a. Es válido también. Mm. Yes. Could be. Okay. Uh, una duda. Creo yeah. que ya me he confundido. Okay. Uh, the y the the Creo que tres horas he confundido. The king es es detrás. Between is en medio. Between con la doble con doble. Yes, W with W. Es ese en medio. Yes. Oh, y entre. Between. Okay. Sí. Yes. Okay, I think Natanya is right there. Okay, so you can practice with her as well. Ok, entonces si quieren empezamos con el cuadro. Yes. Office, office May Fong. Uh, 22. 10. Uh, Avery. Y 21. Ok. Uh, workplace. Inversiones Dromed. Ok. Inversiones. Dromed. Se escribe D-R-O-M-I-D. 
Okay. Uh, department. Credit and collection. Credit and collection. Okay. Uh, <laughs> equivocaste, vaya. Ahorita ID. Sí. ID. Eh, zero, zero. Zero, zero. Five, three. Yeah. Um, one, four. Seven A. Sí. Eh, el guioncito no sé cómo se dice. Va, eh, dash. 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 Ah, pues dash. Um, dash. Zero. Así. Dash. 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 Ah, dash. Pero así, así se llama el de los increíbles, ¿verdad? Dash. El, el maestro gordo, ¿no? Creo que sí, uno de los increíbles que, que se llama Tash. No, el chiquitín, el rubio que corre. Ah, el Dash. que desaparece. <risa> ok. Ready, please. Va lo de abajo, ¿verdad? Sí. Yes. Ah. Dice, escribe. Eh, I want escribe the para... All right. uh, ¿Qué es lo que tenemos alrededor de nuestro uh -huh. trabajo? Los lugares que están en qué? Como punto so de of, referencia sería ahí. Of, of place, sí, of place to describe the location. For example, um, from an university technology. Uh, ¿cómo, cómo, cómo, uh, ¿Cómo sería la, 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 I, la formulación I, correcta para decir se, tengo cerca tal cosa? O around, around my place work, my workplace sería. For example, um, Okay, so is around my work place. Okay. You can say, for example, this is just an example because I don't know which places you have around your workplace, right? No sé qué, qué lugares tienen a su alrededor de su compañía. But you can say, Uh, for example, a Rosario Bakery is around my workplace. Around is. But, uh -huh, but, but. No, pero no todas me las va a decir así, ¿verdad? Oh. Que van a haber unas que, por ejemplo, eh, uh. Dollar City. Uh -huh. Yo sí, yo sí tengo. I have, okay. I have, Dollar City I have. is next to. Wow. Next to Grand Dollar. Usually, usually. Next to Grand Dollar, ok. Ajá. La proposición. Next to, ajá, next to Grand Dollar. And then, for example, Dollar City is between Grand Dollar and Pizza Hut. No. I, I have, I have, um, Chupadero ah. también tenemos a... <laughs> Behind, atrás de la Universidad Tecnológica también. The bar, behind the technology. No, no, ese es ah. chupadero. El, el bar está front down the university. Ah. Uh -huh. Entonces, chupadero así del lugar sucio. Mm, sí, sí, yes, yes. <risa> lo, lo tenemos el behind y el front está el bar, el bar y restaurante. Uh -huh. bar sería y la restaurant. forma correcta ahí, siempre sería bar, bar. Yes, a bar. It should be yeah. a bar. Yes. Ya, que sea sucio no depende de, del inglés. Ya, ya. O sea, yes. de Salvador. A bar. <laughs> a bar. Okay. Um, a bar. Serían cinco. Eh, entonces tenemos que usar next to, between. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué tengo cerca? <laughs> no tengo nada. Tengo una, tengo una gas. El gas. Es el gandola. Tengo que anotar qué cosas tengo alrededor mío porque se me olvida. Eh, Dollar City. Hasta Millennium, es cierto. Millennium Plaza. Nunca lo abren. ¿Qué más hay? 
¿Cuántos son? Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Five. Cinco. Ok. Quiero ver. Tengo una gasolinería, tengo el gran dólar, el dólar city, milenio. ¿Qué más hay? You know, um, like for you to say un bar de mala muerte. Right? <laughs> yes, so you can say a city bar. City bar. City bar. Ah, la avenida. <laughs> okay, no, it's like a bar. Es como un chupadero, <laughs> right? So es it's como a... la forma vulgar de decir chupadero. Ajá. Es un city mm. bar. ¿Qué más tengo? Es que no sé qué tengo. La fuente de es muy difícil. Por... <risa> eh... No está ahí el paseo más arriba en la cuadra. Ajá. Pero es muy difícil también decirlo. Que estoy buscando cosas fáciles. <risa> try, try a difficult one. Por ejemplo, gran, gran dólar, gran dólar. No puedo decir big dólar. O sí. Sí, no. No, Grand Dollar. Porque es el nombre de la empresa, ¿verdad? Yes, ya es no, name. No puedo cambiar. Ajá. Millennium. Eh. Eh, tengo super selectos. Ahí está. Ok. Ya. Yeah. Uh -huh. Bien. Pues, In sí. the mall. In the mall. Bueno. También podría ser el otro. My work. Mm -hmm. My work. Podría ser. Podría ser. Cupat. Podemos ponerle también que su trabajo está pasando el. El cosito es el roundabout. El, el, el redondel. Ah, ah, usted puede poner el i. Ajá. Ajá. O enfrente o a la yeah. página. Ajá. My work. Go uh -huh. back. My, my, my workplace. Hey. Is. Ah, my workplace. Is. Verbo to be. Work. Estar. Uh -huh. Is. Ah, teacher. Uh, también se puede poner my office. Yes. My office. Yes, my office. My, my workplace, office. yes. My workplace is or my office is? Yes, correct. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. My workplace go go past. Go, go past. Is is past? Uh-huh. Passing, uh -huh. sí. But, um, y en este queda... caso el seguro social sería is hospital o solo seguro social Segu seguro social ok ok entonces my workplace is passing the roundabout Be behind Behind. I don't know. Repita lo que dijo, Yvette. The workplace. My workplace. Is, my workplace is passing. Passing. The, yeah. Passing. The roundabout. Yes. 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 Okay. Faltan dos, sí, como. Cross. Vaya, ¿cuál otra? Podría ser, Irma. Mm -hmm. uh, y si y si colocamos my workplace a uh, op opposite uh, frente al semáforo un ejemplo porque el mío está cerca de un semáforo uh -huh. Ay, mío también entonces podría uh -huh. ser sería 
next. Al lado de. No, sería. Pasando, no, sería cross. At the of. At the corners of. Pasando. ¿eh? Ocupa. Passing. Pasando. So it could be um, next to the traffic lights. It could be near. My what is happening is traffic light. No, my, my, my workplace is passing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The traffic uh -huh. light. My one. Ah, the traffic light. Uh -huh. yes. Así. My Irma. workplace. Ajá. Uh -huh. Is passing. Ajá. Uh -huh. The traffic lights. The traffic light. lights. Mm -hmm. uh, my workplace is, is passing. Is passing. Passing. Passing traffic. The, the traffic light. Traffic light. Mm -hmm. Traffic. Traffic. Traffic light. Light. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Bueno, queda una. Sí. Quiero ver. Y si ponemos... My world opposite que frente. Al lado contrario. Al lado contrario. Ok. Y frente. In front of. Ajá, podríamos poner in front of. My workplace in front of. Uh, several crossing. Porque ya que tenemos un semáforo, puede haber un paso peatonal. Frente. O, o podemos cambiarle, ponerle tal vez. Que está. Hello. Teacher, Hi guys. Eh, tenemos una duda. Okay. ¿Cómo se dice duda en inglés? We have a doubt. Oh, I really have. A doubt. We have a eh, doubt. Uh -huh. Sorry. Es que lo, lo de la segunda tarea mm, yes. era personal de cada uno o era entre el, o escribir las tres de cada. O sea, lo, yo escribo lo de José. Lo de Tania no, y viceversa, no. Yeah, it's something personal. I mean, because you don't work in the same company. Uh -huh. No, right? Teacher, pero yo voy a inventar cosas porque literal, mi, el lugar del trabajo, y atrás hay cañales y enfrente solo hay un cañal y una parada. ¿sí? Y a la par sí está Ciudad Real, ¿verdad? Pero... Ok, invent, invent too. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Invent. Por ejemplo, yo puse de Imperial Ramírez, Paz de Park. Entonces, teacher, sería entonces de que cada quien haga sus cinco oraciones, ¿verdad? Yes. So, ah, okay, been, okay. Uh -huh, but you need to support each other, ¿ok? Tienen que apoyarse de su compañero. All right. So, um, go again, Irving. De Imperial Ramírez, Paz de Park. Is passing. Está pasando. Is passing. Está pasando el parque. So, is passing. Con ING. Yes, is passing the park. Pero sería con doble S también, ¿verdad? Yes. Is passing the park. Uh -huh. Correct. Ok, thank you, teacher. Ok. Any other question that you may have? 
no, 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 no. Pues, sí, ahorita no, no. estamos bien. Gracias. Dios. Ok. Let me see. Erika and Franklin. Uh, it, it's Hello. located. Do you need help? help? No? Do you need help? Uh, escuchando el de ella estaba. Ah, sorry. Okay, go, Erika. <laughs> Uh, where is the shoe located? It's located across the shoe. School. Mm -hmm. Esa es la una. Ajá. La dos. Uh, Number two. Number two. Mm -hmm. Where is the full station? It is located in front of a restaurant. Of restaurant, okay. Oh, okay. Number three or number four? Si gusta, continue. Okay. Eh, la mía quedó así, creo. Where is Suburb? Um, Suburbers? Sí, verdad. Suburbers. Suburbios? Suburbios. Ok. Suburbia. Where is Suburbia or Santa Elena of Street number 26 and, and two uh, next to drive school? Mm -hmm. Three along a street, the they Angels. Angels. Mm -hmm. Four between restaurant and, and back. No sé si estará bien. No le puse el nombre al restaurante en el banco. Ok. Así quedaría la mía. Una descripción básica. Ok. So. All right. Sorry. Es una dirección inventada. No voy a, no voy a, no voy a buscar. Ah, ok. So, all right. So, actually, suburbio. Do you have it like this? Así lo tiene como esto. Sí. Suburb. Okay. Suburb. Okay, perfect. Yes. Did you finish? Uh, sí. Yes, finish. Yes, okay. So now let's continue and let's continue with this one. Okay. Let's see. Franklin, help me reading this. Ayúdeme a leer. Name, office, and workplace. And Erika, address, job position, department, and ID. Okay. Uh, my name, name. Name. Pero con, mi, con, pero con mi nombre o con el que está ahí? No, with the one that we have right there. Con el que tenemos ahí ahorita. Okay. Mm, name. Name. Name, perdón. Name. Mauricio Quintanilla. Office. Main of phone uh, seven seven two zero three nine one six four. Say my little workplace our technology company. Okay. Continue. Me? No, Eric. Uh, core place. Work place. Work place. Our own technology company. Address on Roosevelt Street and First Avenue. Avenue? Avenue. Mm -hmm. uh, number A53. Santa Cecilia S S T San Salvador. San Salvador. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Joy, Joy Position Software Design. Designer. Designer. Uh -huh. Department Production. Production. ID MQ. Uh, 
one zero zero eight three five nine. Repeat after me and say zero. 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 Hágale. No, es con de zero. No, con zero. Ah. Zero. 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 Ok. Practice that sound. Practique ese sonido. Now, how do you say young? Dash. Dash. Young. Dash. Ok, let me call you back to the main session. Ok, déjeme lo voy a llamar de nuevo a la sala principal. Give me one second, ok. Ok. Okay, so let me ask you, let me ask you. Okay, so what is located in front of the mall on First Avenue? So it is located in front of the mall on First Avenue. What is it located in front of the mall on First Avenue, guys? What is it located? What is it located in front of the mall on First Avenue? What? The bank, the sport palace, the park, the restaurant. What is it located? In front of the mall. The park. The yes. park. park. Yeah. Correct. Okay. And what is it located across First Avenue behind the restaurant? It's located at Arrows Company. The Arrows Company. Okay. So across First Avenue behind the restaurant, okay? And what is it located on Roosevelt Street between the restaurant and the book world? Arrows Company. Arrows Company, okay. And what is it located along, along Roosevelt Street next to the city hall and the park? What is it located along along Roosevelt Street next to the city hall next to in the park? Mm -hmm. What is it located along Roosevelt? Around Roosevelt yeah. next to the city hall? Team. Next to the city hall and book. Um, book world. Okay. Mm, are you sure? <coughs> are you sure? Pues que tengo duda. <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. so what is it located along, a lo largo Siguiendo, de? A lo largo de la Roosevelt. Uh -huh. La calle Roosevelt, próximo a la city mall. Wall, y el parque mall. sería the mall. The mall. The mall. Correct. Okay. Very good. So now I'm going to play a recording. Les voy a poner una grabación. Necesito que escuche a qué lugar, which place, a qué lugar los están dirigiendo. All right. So ellos van a dar la dirección y usted tiene que elegir a qué de los lugares, a cuál de los lugares que se ve acá los están dirigiendo. Okay. So let me... Uh, let me show you the sound. Give me one second. Ahorita se lo pongo. Okay. A. Go straight on, then take the first left onto Green Street. Walk past the library, and it's the building next to the library on the left. B. Go straight on, go past the traffic lights, you'll see a shop on the right. Go past that, 
and it's on the right next to the shop. C. Go straight on. Go past the traffic lights and go straight on until you get to the roundabout. At the roundabout, turn left. Go past the theatre. It's the building next to the theatre, opposite the hospital. D. Go straight on, go past the traffic lights and take the second right onto King's Road. Go past the bookshop. It's the building next to the bookshop opposite the cafe. Okay. This recording uh, was brought to you by the British. Uh -huh. uh, la pronunciación <laughs> es bien rara. Era como que era un era como que era alguien que hablaba francés hablando en, en inglés no. o italiano. Pero la pronunciación era bien rara. Yes, it is British. It's Britannica. Ah, okay. Yes. Okay. But were you able to get the main place? ¿Pudieron escuchar los lugares a los que les estaba dirigiendo or no? No. No. Solo entendí que pasaba el semáforo. Yo me quedé en pasar el semáforo y gira a la derecha. Después de la tienda. Creo que, Después del creo que uno, el uno sí me lleva al Underground Station. Uno sí. Uno me lleva al Underground Station. El otro. No veo, no veo el mapa. Yo no sé. Uno creo que. El último creo que lo lleva al Italian Restaurant. Okay, no. Italian restaurant. Eh, uno también me lleva al hospital. Al hospital? Al cinema. Al cinema. Al cinema, okay. All right, so lo voy a poner otra vez. Okay, vamos primero, tratemos de los más fáciles, right? The, the easiest. Okay, so remember that we start here. Aquí estamos. You are here, aquí. Aquí empezamos. Okay. Y mire mi flechita donde va. Okay. Right. So let's see. I'm going to play it. Right. Go straight on, then take the first left onto Green Street. Walk past the library, and it's the building next to the library on the left. B. Go straight on, go past the traffic lights. You'll see a shop on the right. Go past that and it's on the right next to the shop. C. Go straight on. Go past the traffic lights and go straight on until you get to the roundabout. At the roundabout, turn left. Go past the theatre. It's the building next to the theatre opposite the hospital. D. Go straight on, go past the traffic lights and take the second right onto King's Road. Go past the bookshop. It's the building next to the bookshop opposite the cafe. Okay. Mm, lo que yo logré escuchar es que when Es que todas empiezan con que sigue por la calle, pasa el tráfico. En una escuché que dice sigue el redondel delante de la tienda y el on the station. Y sí, esa fue una. Y la, una, la otra que logré entender más o menos era sigue por la, por la calle, pasa el tráfico y la tienda de compra o la tienda y el café. Okay, so the traffic lights, los semáforos, okay? The traffic lights. Okay, so the speaker A gives directions to which place? Letter A. Post office. office. The, the post office, okay? The post office, okay? The post office. What about the speaker B? Huh? Their station on their station. Another station. Another the station. Underground, 
underground, okay. Underground, underground station. station, uh huh. Number, well, let us see. Uh, cinema. The cinema, okay. And the last one? Italian restaurant. Uh, around, so Italian so restaurant. restaurant. Okay, all right. I'm going to play one more time. Se la voy a poner una vez más, pero ya con las respuestas que tenemos hasta el momento. Okay? So you can hear. Okay? Pon atención. Okay? Pay attention. Pay attention. Um, give me one second. A. Go straight on. Then take the first left onto Green Street. Walk past the library and it's the building next to the library on the left. B. Go straight on. Go past the traffic lights. You'll see a shop on the right. Go past that and it's on the right next to the shop. C. Go straight on. Go past the traffic lights and go straight on until you get to the roundabout. At the roundabout, turn left. Go past the theatre. It's the building next to the theatre, opposite the hospital. D. Go straight on, go past the traffic lights, and take the second right onto King's Road. Go past the bookshop. It's the building next to the bookshop, opposite the cafe. Okay. This recording was brought to you by... All right. So now, what do you think? I think the British accent is perfect. We share. Yes, Irma. El literal D no es restaurant Italy. Uh -huh, it's not okay, it's, restaurant. So es, what? The, es de cafeteria. Cafeteria. cafeteria? Uh -huh. Okay, let's see. Lights and take uh -huh. the second right onto King's Road. Okay. Go past the bookshop. It's special. Okay, let us see. The D. Parte, D. Go straight on, go past the traffic lights, and take the second right onto King's Road. Go past the bookshop. It's the building next to the bookshop opposite the cafe. What is the answer? Cafeteria. The cafeteria? Are you sure? Your question is about the letter D. Yes, it says opposite the cafe. Oh, lo opuesto de la cafetería de lo opuesto si era el que está enfrente o no o fue mal yo yo le entiendo que cruza el semáforo pasa el semáforo cruza la derecha en la calle Kings después te redondea la derecha pasas el box shop enfrente del box siguiente el próximo café que sería el restaurante italiano ok it says Aha, uh -huh. it says go on past the traffic lights and then yes. we take the King's Road, yes. right? Okay. So yes. past the bookshop and is yes. the building, then, it says, is the building next to the bookshop opposite the cafe? Oh, the answer is bus station. The bus station. Because it says, <laughs> is, the, is the building Pasando. next to Pasando. Pasando. La tienda de libros. Opuesto al café. Opuesto al café. Bus station. Okay. Ajá. Es mejor mandar la ubicación. Y se lo va a usar Waze. Hace el Waze habla inglés, pero bueno. No, okay. Was it difficult? Yes, at the beginning, maybe, right? At the beginning. A little bit, a little bit. Okay, so then let's move. Okay, so we have one exercise. Let's see if we can resolve it, okay? So true or false, 
this one is true or false. Look at the image, okay? Look at the image, look at the image. Okay, so it says there is a bank. We have Cardiff Road, the Cardiff Road, the Oxford Street, and the King Street, okay? So let's see. Number one, it says there is a bank on King Street. There is a bank, true or false? True. 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 Okay. True. Next, the petrol station is near the library. The library. False. 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 Okay. There is a supermarket next to the hospital. A supermarket next to the True. hospital. True. 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 Okay, number four. The museum is between the library and the train station. The museum. True. 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 Okay. True. The museum. True. Yes, true. Okay. The park is opposite the bank. The park. False. 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 Okay. False. Then the bakery is between the car park and the petrol station. The bakery. True. True. Between the car park and the petrol station? True. 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 There is a restaurant on Cardiff Road. False. False or true? True. 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 False. False. Because it's a bakery. Okay. False. False. The airport is near the train station. The airport is near the train station. True. False. False. True. False. The 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 airport. So the airport mm -hmm. is airport? near the train station. Near. Yeah. Near. True or false. True. 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 Okay. There is a jewelry next to the park. Joyeria. There is a jewelry next True. to the park. True. 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 The museum is opposite the library. False. False. True. False. True. True. Ryan, come on, okay. Let's check. Okay, let's check. Very good. Yes, okay. 100. Excellent. Was it difficult? No, right? It was not difficult. It was easy. Easy. Okay. All right, so now let's move, but now is your turn. You are going to create role plays. Va a crear pequeños diálogos como ese que tengo aquí yo. Letter A, Brian, letter B, please, Yvette. Excuse me, where's, where's the post office? Go straight into leave, then go straight. Again, in the wheel, sit the post office in the corner. Okay, so the start is this. Aquí está usted. The start, aquí. It says, go straight, okay, go straight and turn left, okay? Turn left, then go straight again, vaya de nuevo recto, and you will see, and verás. You will see es va a ver, okay? And verás the post office in the corner. Va a ver la post office en la esquina. Okay? So now is your turn. What you are going to do, ¿qué va a hacer? En este caso, lo que va a hacer va a crear dos diálogos pequeñitos. Okay? Here we have the indications. Eran cuatro, pero vamos a poner los dos. All right? Just two. Dos diálogos pequeñitos, así como el que yo hice, A y B. Solo A y B. 
uno pregunta y el otro da la dirección. Okay. And you are going to base on this image. Se va a basar en esta imagen. Recuerde, aquí es donde usted está parado, aquí. Y de aquí usted empieza a dar la dirección. Okay. Si quiere ir al baño, right? Si quiere ir a la pet shop, okay? A la library, the car park, etc. Okay? So, do you have questions? Do you have questions? No? Okay. But first, I'm going to take the attendance, okay? Once again, the attendance. Brian Antonio Antonio, Brian Antonio Castro Molina? Present. <laughs> Thank you. Ticia Marcelo Ramirez Morán? Present. Thank you. Elmer Alexander Coto Sorto? Eric Alexander Escalante Barrillas? Erika Beatriz Reyes Méndez. Present. Franklin Emanuel Flores Portillo. Present. Gerson Josué Abarca Aranda. Irma del Tránsito Alegría Martínez. Present. Irving Francisco Peraza Herrera. Irving. Irving. Sorry, no, no me funcionaba el botón. Present. Okay. Yvette Elvira Aquino Peña. Present. Ok. Eh, Johnny Iván Argueta Argueta. José Enrique Siliesar Alas. Present. Jocelyn Guadalupe Romero Évora. Kelvin Omar Martínez Ramírez. Liliana Beatriz Jiménez Colorado. Present. Luis Ernesto, Ernesto Nuila Castro. Marco Rubén García Rodríguez. Present. Reinaldo Alberto Vázquez Torres. En Tania Vanessa Moreno Navas. Present. Zuleima Guadalupe Chicas Aguilar. Present. Thank you. Okay, guys. So we are going to go again in teams and you need to actually answer those. Remember, you need to create A and B. Okay, letter A and letter B. All right, let's go. So, Tania. Um, two. <laughs> Yo lo primero que pregunto es el tablet. <laughs> Vaya, si gusta usamos el school. Okay. Y ¿Cuál otra? The school. ¿Dónde está la escuela? Algo que se que es el pub. O pub. Wow. ¿Cómo es? Okay. In this case, um, actually that is going to be the pub. So what is the pub? Pub. El pub es un bar. Un bar. El bar. pub. Pop. Ah, let's go pop. Ah, let's go, Irma. Let's, let's go, go to. <laughs> let's, let's go, go to, to, to the pop. Oh my God, Irma. Ah, Irma. <laughs> Ay, no, quiero vacación. Yo buscando el baño usted. Ajá. Ay, bien. Acaba. Okay, the pop. Yes. Is, is okay. the, el bar. Yes, the pop. Oh, yes. Bar. Okay. Ah, ya entendí. Ok. No, bueno. Sí, o ah. sea, vaya, Marcelo va a ser, o sea, yo le voy a preguntar una a Marcelo, Marcelo me va a preguntar una a mí, y Marcelo y yo le vamos a preguntar una al, al otro compañero. Ya. A usted, Marco. Ya. Marcelo. O sea, usted, Marco. Ma Sería online. No. No, tenemos a ver. Si al recto está Go Street. Hasta. 
a, a la izquierda tendría que. Mm -hmm. On the left. On the left. Con strain. Uh, I'll go on the left. Mm -hmm. On the left. Mm -hmm. Go. Siga recto y luego a la izquierda. Mm -hmm. Got on the leg. Y. Quiero ver. Come and say, I'm on the leg. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo queremos llegar al museo, teacher? Mm -hmm. O sea, y luego. Come straight and go. No. Straight. Y luego. Mm -hmm. eh, y luego, and go. Lay them. Mm, okay, so you, okay, so you go straight, right? You go straight. You go straight and then you turn. ¿A qué lado va a girar? Si quiere llegar al museo, esperen, lo voy a mostrar en mi pantalla para que la vean. Give me one second, okay? Give me one second. Okay, so we, we are here. We are here. Start, right? So. <laughs> We go straight, right? Good. Vamos recto. Go straight ahead, right? Vamos rectos hacia adelante. Go straight ahead. Ok. Good. Ahora, si yo quiero llegar al museo, ¿dónde giro? Uh, ¿A la derecha? Go and turn. ¿Cómo se dice girar, girar a la derecha? ¿Se recuerda? Eh... To write. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you go straight ahead and turn right. Después que, que, que giremos a la derecha. So turn right and pass. Oh, I'm sorry. And pass. ¿Qué va a pasar? Uh, tow, tow hall. Town hall, yes. So, oh. pass the town hall and you uh, see uh, the, museum. the museum opposite the library. Oh. Al lado opuesto de la librería. Opposite the library. Or, you can say, in the corner. The museum is in the corner. En la esquina. O puede decir que está opuesto a la librería, porque está, ¿ve? Opposite. O puede decir que está en la esquina, como usted quiera. Ok. Ok. Make sure, recuerda que también tiene el vocabulario aquí. Ok. Diferentes expresiones para que no se pierda. Ok. okay. All right. One more. Uno más. One more. Ok. Eh, podemos, quiero ver. Pero es que fíjate que no sé si, teacher. Yes. Eh, nosotros, nosotros pusimos, eh, bueno, la pregunta sería, excuse me, where's the museum? Where is the museum? Museum. Entonces pusimos, pero no sé si, bueno, yo tengo dudas. Yes. Uh, go and stream. Ah, permítame. Entonces, lo voy a leer bien. Ah, uh, pues go and stream on the traffic line. No sé si así sería. Ok, so. Digamos, sigue recto sobre el semáforo y cruce la derecha eh, sobre la calle. Ok, give me one second. I'm going to show you my screen. Ok, so you are here, right? So uh -huh. you go straight ahead, right? Va de largo así recto, go straight ahead. In the and, traffic line? And, uh -huh. In the traffic and line? On, on the uh -huh. right. And, yes, and you would turn right. Okay. And then you would, and then go straight ahead. Over, over over the street over the highest street highest street, highest street. 
here, high street. This is the high street. ¿Cuál es la high street? Aquí está okay. el high street, okay? So high street, and you will see, you will see, va a ver, you will see the museum in the corner, or you will see the museum opposite the library. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Like uh -huh. that? <laughs> but but I mean it's a good way for you to practice. Okay, está bien porque practica más. Entonces, ¿cómo dijo sobre el semáforo? Oh, go straight ahead and you will see the traffic lights. Recuerde que el you will see va a ver. You will see. And you will see the traffic lights. And then, y después, gire a la derecha. And then, como le he puesto yo aquí. Then. Después. Okay. Okay. Then, turn right. Después wow. gire a la derecha. Así como está en el chat, más o menos. Sí. And the traffic light turn right. Así, así sería sobre el semáforo. Okay. Go straight with the um, track line. Okay, go straight ahead. So, Ese go straight ahead es como ir y recto pero al frente. Ahead. Go straight ahead, ajá, como caminar hacia el frente. So go straight ahead and you will see the mm. traffic light. Así como se lo ha puesto, traffic lights. And then, y después, then turn right. El de en es como para referirse de luego. Después. Y luego, y después, y luego. Secuencia. Luego la, ajá, ajá, y luego cruce la derecha. Uh -huh. Sobre over, over the high street. Correct, right, over high street. And you will sit the... You over the high street. Okay. Yo puedo dejar hasta así nomás la, la oración sobre la calle. Yes. No, pero, sí, pero, pero no es muy exacta, ¿verdad? Ajá, uh -huh, no. Uh -huh. So, ajá, uh -huh, and uh -huh, over, this, oh, over the high street. High street, and you will see the, the museum, museum. 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 Where? ¿Dónde lo voy a ver? Museum, but um, library. In the corner. In, in the, the corner. corner. Oh, in, in the corner. corner. Or in the corner, or opposite, or in the corner. Okay. One more. Okay. Uh, go straight ahead, and you will traffic lights. Uh, you will see. You will mm -hmm. see the traffic light, and then on the third right. Turn right. Over, over, over the high street, museum. And you will see the museum. Museum. Museum in the corner. Perfect, like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. In the corner. All right, perfect. Okay, the other one. Me falta uno, verdad? Yes. Okay. Okay, continue. I'm going to go to another room. Let me see who, Erika and Franklin. Okay. Where is the toilet? Creo que dice arriba, ¿verdad? Where is the toilet? Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. ¿Te pierdes? Mm. No creo que escuche. Mm. 
creo que no escucho. Maybe having issues with her internet connection. Tal vez tienen problemas con el internet. Okay. Mm -hmm. ¿En dónde preguntaron? ¿Dónde preguntaste? Eh, where is the toilet? Toilet. Me preguntó. Yes. <laughs> ah, okay. Perdón. Excuse me. Uh, excuse uh, me. Where is the toilet? Mm -hmm. eh, go straight. Eh, Util your you reach the traffic link lights. Eh, pues, hola, traffic lights. Traffic light. Traffic. Traffic lights. Traffic light. Yes. And um, go street. Uh, on the. On the left. Mm -hmm. The left. From the left. The... Solamente que no sé cómo es que se dice. Que parece como una cerquita la que está ahí, no sé. Mm. Yes, so you will see a bench. Or you can say, mm, es como un bridge, como un puentecito. Mm. A bridge, un puente, bridge. Eh, sería entonces, eh, un de left, eh, when using the bridge mm -hmm. okay all right so let me see Tania le voy a compartir mi pantalla okay Tania can you please guide me once again guíeme nuevamente Sería go, go straight. Mm -hmm. eh, until you reach the traffic link. Traffic lights. Traffic lights. Eh, on the left. Mm -hmm. On the left. Mm -hmm. uh, when cruising the bridge. Okay, but I'm here. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Uh, on the on the ridge okay so you said go straight ahead you will see the traffic lights and turn left me quedaba donde me donde me dijo que girar a la izquierda ajá go straight okay on the ridge okay aquí eso me dijo que Fuera recto, aquí voy recto, mire. Me fui. Ok. ¿Cómo dice gire? Ok. No, 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 sería, sería. Sería on the left. 
on the left. Está bien como me ha guiado. Lo que sucede es que solo me dijo, go straight, siga recto. Entonces yo me voy, sigo recto. Pero okay. después de decir go straight, ¿se puede decir on the, on the reach? No. No, porque yo aquí, aquí no veo el bridge. Yo no veo el bridge, el bridge es súper lejos, mire. ¿Cómo dice usted? Vaya, en ese caso me dice, siga recto. Después va a haber la post office. Entonces gire a su derecha y siga recto nuevamente. Le falta todo esto, mire, que yo recorra todo Sería, and you, and you will see the post office. Ajá. In the reach. Ok. In the reach. Usted me quiere llevar hasta aquí de un solo, pero no. Ajá. Tenemos que pasar todavía esto. Entonces, está bien. Bye. You go straight ahead, va a irse recto. You go straight, you see the traffic lights, you turn left, and you will see the post office. ¿Qué hago después que veo la post office? On the read, read. ¿Qué hago después de que veo la post office, Erika? Eh, aquí estoy. Uh -huh. Para llegar aquí, ¿cómo hago? Go. Go es to, 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 to read. Turn right. To, turn right. To, ¿Qué okay. sería? Doblar a la derecha, ¿verdad? Ok, yes. Turn right. Uh -huh. Turn right. Uh, when cruising the bridge ok uh -huh. um, <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, again, and uh, you will see toilet. The toilet. Very good. Yes. Okay. So you see, it's not difficult. No es difícil, pero tenemos que aprendernos el vocabulario. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Right. Very good. So you are missing one. Le falta uno, ¿no? Huh? ¿O oh, no? Ya lo terminaron. Los dos. Eh, sí. Es que nos estuvimos preguntando dónde te que viniera usted. Ah, ok. Give me one second. Then I'm going to call you to the main room. Le voy a hablar a la, a la sesión principal. Give me one second. Okay, let's wait for the other ones. Okay, let's wait for the other ones. Okay, so we have Suleima, Liliana. Okay, Suleima and Liliana, can you please uh, do a role play? One okay. of, the, of the places, yes. Okay. Excuse me, where the museum? Where, where is the museum? Where is the museum? Don't stray. And turn right and the past to, to have the museum, 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 and the cornet of the string kingston. Okay, all right. Uh, Brian, Brian, and your, and your team, one of the role plays. Brian and your team. Brian and your team. One role play. Yes. Yeah. 
Es que se me había trabado la máquina. <laughs> okay. All right. Eh, excuse me, where is the pet shop? Past the light traffic in the left. And another another location is where's the toilet? Past the light traffic at the end of the Oxford Street on the left. Okay. So go straight ahead, you will pass the traffic lights. At the end of the Oxford Street, in the left. On the left. On the left. Okay. Right. Yvette. Okay. Excuse me, where is the school? Um, go straight right before the traffic light on the right and hand side. Okay. Irma. Excuse me, where's the pop? Pop or pop, teacher? The pop? Pop. Pop. Uh, take a right, the tour left on the Kingston Road, past the library. Okay, Opposite. let's see. Let's see, Irma. So I'm here, estoy aquí. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. Guíeme nuevamente. Uh, take a right. Take, okay, okay, so on the right. Take on the right. Okay, on the right. Uh -huh. Uh, then, uh, ya le digo, perdón. Sería, um, ten, of the, ten, turn left. Turn left. Uh, right, Kingston. Okay, on the road, Kingston, okay. Past the library. Library. Opposite on the pub. Is, is in front. Is in front of the library. Yes. Repeat after me and say library. 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 Okay. Irvin. Um, excuse me, where is the museum? Museum. Museum. Go straight ahead and you will see the traffic lights on the tour line over the high stream and you will see museum in the corner. Perfect. Jose. Um. Ahí comenzamos. Ok. Yes. Uh, go straight ahead. Go to pass the traffic light. Mm -hmm. And you will see a positive tow half. Is the pet shop. Oh, opposite. Okay. opposite. Mm -hmm. Okay, the pet shop. Okay. So, guys, we are going to stop right here because of the time. Vamos a dejarlos aquí por el tiempo. But tomorrow, pero mañana, le voy a hacer preguntas así. Where is the town hall located? Y yo espero que me lo digan bien bonito. ¿Ok? Así. Y voy a tra traer otro mapa con más lugares. All right? So, please try to study. Estudie las direcciones. ¿Ok? Tiene el vocabulario. All right? Do you have any question for me before we go? Questions? Preguntas? Uh, one question. Yes. Pero no es de la clase en sí. No sé si hablaron esto anteriormente. Me hubo un mensaje. No sé cuándo es que sería eso. Ah, lo de la encuesta. Ajá. Uh -huh. Oh, that would be on Wednesday, el miércoles. Ah, oh, ok. Lo vamos okay. a hacer en la clase, sí. Uh -huh. Ok. Exactly. Yes. Any other question? Otra duda? No? Okay, guys. So if you don't have any other doubt, you may go. 
Okay, have a good night. Rest. Descanse. Okay? Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, Marco. Good night. Good night, Jose. Good night. Do you have any question? Yes. Okay. No? Okay. Bye, Marco. <laughs>